now I've got the basement clean I'm just gonna let it air out a little bit and then I want to show you some things that I've done to help us out before I start putting things back in Cut it off for a minute. Hey y'all, welcome to Heritage Ways. And I want to give you a few tips on your basement area of your RV that I ran across with a friend from a friend of ours. And I want to pass I want to pass these tips along to you as well because it may be something that you would like to do and haven't thought of. The first tip I want to give you is plastic storage bin. This is a three-tier storage bin as you can see in my um, RV basement is tall enough that I was able to fit this in here and what I did I secured it with two screws to the floor and two screws to the sidewall that way it's secure in here now what do I keep in here I keep um, my extra water filter cartridge my water line that hooks up here for my outdoor water and and various water type items okay and then in another drawer I keep um, liquid things like uh, heavy-duty silicone spray some silicone caulk some WD-40 but I also keep um, some latex gloves that I use when I'm working with the uh, with the dump hose and then in the third bin it's just random miscellaneous things like duct tape electrical tape uh, different screws um, washers with uh, screen filters just random things that I might use around the RV as we're traveling uh, that I might need okay another thing that I've got here and I'll go the other side because I probably need to show you a better picture another thing that I've done and I'm hoping you can see this I've got little D-rings attached to the wall here I've got one on the far side and one here with a long bungee cord and that's where I and that's where I secure my tables so the fold-out tables that we use when we're camping when we're getting ready to pack up and leave or if we're not going to use them they set flush against this wall with this bungee cord holding them now this bungee cord here I've got it to fit perfect for for a five gallon water jug and I've got one on the other side as well because one of the things we do is we want to make sure we're drinking good water we don't want to drink the water coming through the tap even though we do use those filters so another tip that I've got for you is right up here let me see if I can adjust it so you can see better is right up here and what I did is this is a fishing pole mount there's two of them there's one on the far end and one on this end so the tip will fit down there and the real end of the fishing rod will fit here and they're tight fit so you just push them up between there and there's a slot for the fishing pole to fit the thing that we did was we put command I put command hooks up here that way when we're traveling we can hang the uh, bike helmets up here uh, one thing you guys may not know but you may know but I'll throw it at you anyway is a lot of places where you camp especially state parks they will not let kids ride their bicycles if they do not have a helmet so you need to make sure you have a helmet for your children especially and you may want one as well so those are a couple of things that we've done from a basement storage standpoint to try to help out with storage maybe you can take some of these tips and use them on your rv for yourself thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you like our content and give us a like or a thumbs up if you like our like this video and make comments give us comments any feedback you want to give us maybe you can help us out with storage on our rv as well thank you guys for watching bye bye